Are we ready? Okay. Francesca McGee, a difficult performance, but so many positives to take from what was a really tight loss against Trailfinders. What are your immediate thoughts following the game? Yeah, I think it was a really close game. We have lots of positives to take from it. We also know what we need to change and, and go after for next week. Our discipline just wasn't good enough, and, and that's where we really, we really struggled there. But so many positives to take into next week as well, and I'm looking forward to it. Just to go right back to the start, uh, one of the key things coming out of the Harquins game was that we just didn't start quick enough. We weren't on it straight from the off. Here, although we did concede an early try, it certainly seemed like the resilience and the defence was a lot stronger than it was last week. Yeah, absolutely. Our defence was a different beast really today. We've been talking about like being in the jungle and, and being in a chaotic environment, and that's how we're training. And I think that really came into today. And I think the girls are going to be super proud, and we're going to have lots of positives to take from our defence as well. I say certainly the most positive uh, element of the game was that second half. F certainly for the first 20 minutes, we scored a try and we were right on top of them, right on their line. We just couldn't capitalise. What do you think was it that just meant we just couldn't quite get over? I think we were in the, their 22 so often. I think we just need to we need to calm down. We need to keep our heads and we just need to you know take our time. You know they're like we'll get it. We'll get them on the edge or we'll get them through the middle. We just need to calm down and just and let them get there. Credit to Trailfinders, obviously, they, that was a real nexus moment, that interception. From there, what were their real strengths into the last 20 minutes as they sort of closed it out? Yeah, I think they know how to close a game for sure. They know how to come back, and they're a really strong physical team, and they really they really did get us with that. But, um, you know, we're strong and physical too. We just need to learn to be that all throughout the game. Certainly. So our next home match is next week. Mm -hmm. uh, just a word on the crowd. They were really roaring us on throughout, especially when we were on top. They were really carrying us. What, what were your thoughts on them? Yeah, the crowd is always actually really good here. You can always hear everyone. You can hear every single voice there. And, you know, the chants and, and just hearing them on the sidelines supporting you, it's incredible. And we're looking to have a bigger crowd next week as well. Brilliant. And then finally, going into this next week, training for Bristol Bears, what do you think they'll bring and what do you think you'll be looking to work on throughout this week? Yeah, I think we're probably going to focus on ourselves a little bit here as well. We've absolutely got things that we need to work on. And, you know, like we lost the game in those 20 minutes and we need to really focus on that and how we can keep our heads in the game. Brit Bears are an incredible team. They've got lots of depth. So, yeah, they've got speed, they've got kickers, they've got strength. So we've just got to match that as well. Perfect. Fran, thank you very much.